Previously on Project 06, we decided to go through Project Wildfire. And those were three stage mods from Sonic and the Secret Rings. But some modders within the game have started to create character mods now. So with that being said, I'd like to give a shout out to Beats for creating the Metal Sonic mod as they have finally started to roll out character mods in Project 06. Alright, so here we are in Project 06. As you can see here, we kind of have the options mods here. So we go ahead and select that. And then you go ahead in here and pick characters, and then Sonic. And then you can see right there, we have Metal Sonic right in front of us. So what they decided to do is they decided to create a whole different interface within the main menu to be able to select your different mods that you've downloaded for Project 06. And it's actually a really nice and easy way to be able to select your different character mods that you've downloaded. As you can see here, I've only downloaded Metal Sonic so far, but once I decide to, you know, release some more mods or if I download any more in the near future, um, you can go ahead and just be able to swap between them and pick them. You don't have to completely close the game or anything like that. You just go ahead and select the ones that you want. And you're able to do that. It also looks like they might even have plans for the other characters. It looks like they have a long list of them here as well. Um, maybe when after the silver release comes out or whatever they decide between then. But it's really cool to see that there's going to be so much support in the near future for this game. So I'm going to be running through two stages here. And the first run we're going to be running through is just normal Metal Sonic. And Metal Sonic actually has his own super form within this mod. And I'm going to be running through another stage to be able to show off that. That. So here we are with Metal Sonic here, we are now in aquatic base with him, and you can notice right away, just his model looks absolutely insane here. It looks so pretty, and it's actually super detailed, I'm very impressed by, you know, this being the first character mod that was released for Project 06 here. Um, overall, he doesn't have a whole lot different other than Sonic has, other than his running animation, he is flying and it looks like he's actually using his jet engine that you see here on his back, which is a super cool detail. And then similar to Sonic Adventure 1 and 2, I believe. If you go ahead and do the spin dash here, he actually has his little protection diamond that he uses here. So it's not a spin dash anymore, so I can't use it to gain momentum, but it is more of a shield here. But. We'll go ahead and run through Aquatic Base here. Um, I'm super excited to play through this stage again. Um, it is actually one of my favorite stages in just normal 06, even though it is kind of a longer stage. Um, but overall, I actually really like it, and I really like the atmosphere for kind of Aquatic Base, just being underwater. And it's like an Eggman base underwater. It's super kind of like, oh my goodness. Um, it's super detailed in terms of like the atmosphere and everything like that. And that's something that I really enjoy within this stage. Now you may be wondering why I might be wearing different clothes or it might be the lighting might be a little bit different in the webcam here compo uh, compared to the intro that I had made. Um, so I'd actually already done a, a video about Metal Sonic here. Um, I kept the intro the same just because it was kind of the same intro that I was going to do anyways. Um, but I actually ended up recording both stages with Metal Sonic, and I completely just did not record the gameplay at all. So it's just me completely talking to, like, a black screen. Um, so it was not something that I think you guys want to enjoy, it's just my face talking about absolutely nothing. So, <laughs> I thought that was kind of funny that I just completely forgot to, you know, record that. And I was like, really? I was like, I completely forgot that? But I think it was just something with my OBS settings that I had kind of been messing around with in a previous recording and I just had never changed it back to the way that I wanted it to. There's actually a really cool feature with the ball physic here in um, Aquatic Base that the Project 06 team decided to change. So after, I'm going to get a little bit further on here, but they actually changed it when you get hit instead of whenever a laser hits you and you just end up falling. The ball actually ends up getting smaller, so I'll show it up here once I get kind of towards the end, just in case I get hit too many times, but here I'll get hit by this one right here. So it doesn't really knock us back at all, and it actually doesn't just completely evaporate. We actually just kind of keep the ball, um, and it's a super cool detail, and I think it's something that it should have been in the original 06. Alright, so here we are back as Metal Sonic. I decided to just kind of go ahead and skip through Tails' section there. Just because I just want to show off the Metal Sonic parts, I don't want to really show off the Tails sections at all. Um, but I was kind of thinking as I was playing through that, I'm actually super happy that they decided to do character mods within this. I've always seen that there's mods for like the normal 06 if you mod like your consoles. And it's always been something that I've been like really interested in. Being able to mod that, you know, get different characters or skins or stuff like that, that, you know, the other characters have. And it's something that I'm super happy that they decided to do, and I hope they continue to. It looks like Beats has come out with a few different ones. I saw that to 
day, I think he came out with an Adventure Sonic mod, which looks really cool. Um, and then he's also done like Unleashed Sonic, and I think he did like Sega Superstar Sonic, like the the like weird Sega tennis game, which I thought was kind of funny. And I remember playing that game as a kid on the Wii, and I was like, oh, well, this is cool. And, like, the only thing I ever wanted to do was play a Sonic and Shadow and just go super, and then just, like, destroy the tennis ball with their super forms. I always thought that was a really cool thing, but I never was, like, super big into the game. And I was surprised they did tennis, or even, like, any sports. I understand, like, the racing games, and the racing games are actually really fun, the Sega and All-Stars Racing and the transformed installation that they'd ended up doing um, as a sequel. I thought that was super cool. Um, and I'm actually recording this a day after the um, Nintendo Direct, and I was surprised to see that they made a Samba de Amigo game. I was surprised that Sega even was making another one. I remember seeing that, I was like, Amigo? I was like, what are you doing here? <laughs> I was so confused. But I've never actually played them, I just remember them from those games, so... Alright, so now that Knuckles has cleared the way for us, I'm gonna try to not get hit by these missiles. Please don't hit me. It's kind of funny looking that he's like running on the ball, but he's like levitating, so he's not like actually on it, but kind of goofy looking. But what do you do when it's just a, like a character swap? Um, no! Alright, I definitely just didn't uh, die on this little ball section here. You didn't notice that, so we're gonna move on here. There we go. I don't know why I was having struggle like figuring that out. I guess I just didn't remember that you had to homing attack it. I don't know, maybe I was just being a little slow. <laughs> um, but I was, I'm super happy to see that they are creating more mods for this, and I hope they continue to do that, whether it be, you know, like the creator of this mod beats, or if other modders decided to, you know, hop over to Project 06 and start making mods for it as well. Um, I think it would be, you know, super cool to see that kind of continue to be a thing, and I'm super excited to see some more stage mods as well, with like Project Wildfire and everything like that. I know that I've been like, I follow his Twitter, the guy that created that, um, and I know that he overall has been working on more different like stages from secret rings and i'm super excited to see what he does with those so i definitely think that it is something you know that they are going to be continuing to release mods for this and i'm super excited for that but it sounds like that the silver um story might be coming out soon from what i've heard but I'm not 100% sure. I know that like I've seen snippets in it. It seems like he's making really good progress on it. And I hope it's something that we end up seeing soon here. All right, so the other stage that I decided to do is White Acropolis. Um, I felt like White Acropolis was a super fitting stage for him, just being another Eggman-based stage. And I remember saying in the last video that I ended up recording, I don't know how I remember what I said because I ended up just deleting the footage. Uh, but I remember that I would, was talking about, kind of within the stage, it reminded me of that. It'd be really cool to see if Metal Sonic got a, like, story mode in a way. Not like a full-on game like Shadow the Hedgehog or anything like that, where it's like only him as the main character. But it'd be really cool whatever they decide, you know, for the next installment, or even if they decide to do ever, like, an adventure-style game where it's multiple stories within the game. I think it'd be really cool that if they did Metal Sonic as like a character with that and kind of see, you know, Eggman's side of it, but kind of through Metal Sonic's eyes. It'd be cool to have stages, uh oh, I hit a tree. <laughs> um, it'd be cool to see stages similar to this one where we're able to, you know, run through Eggman's like facilities and stuff like that and kind of see, you know, the different areas, you know, throughout the world that he's like put his bases and kind of like his like mastermind plans and kind of see like the early like stages of those plans and everything like that. I think that'd be like something super cool to see. And I think that it would be like really cool to, you know, kind of, you know, bring back Metal Sonic in a way. I know that like he was in Mania and everything like that, but it's kind of different with Mania in the sense that like we were just going back to CD in a way. So it'd be kind of cool to see more of like modern Metal Sonic, I guess would be the right way of putting it. It'd be really cool to see that. I'm so glad that that jump works now, because I remember in original 06, I used to die on that part all the time. My game like started dropping frames all of a sudden right now, but I think we're good now. So, But here is his super form that they decided to choose for him. Yes, and they ended up doing a, like a yellow aura around the metal of him, and then making his metal completely yellow, similar to Sonic. 
So it's very similar to that. I thought it was very interesting that they decided to change that. And I don't think Super Metal Sonic has ever truly been a thing. It might have been in the comics. I'm not like 100% sure on that. Someone can correct me if I am wrong. But from my understanding is that I don't think that they've ever done a Metal Sonic with like a super form like this. I know that there's like Neo Metal Sonic and there's different forms of him, which is super cool. And I really like that as a like a feature. Um, and I thought that would be kind of, that's kind of what I thought when I had seen that there was like a, like a super form for uh, Metal Sonic within this one. I thought it might be Neo Metal Sonic, but it ended up being this. And I'm kind of really surprised by it and I actually ended up really liking that. Oh my goodness, I almost lost all of my rings last second there, but I'm glad that I didn't. All right, let me grab some more rings up here and then we can go back to being super, oh, uh, so cool looking. I love the animation and oh my goodness, my game. I like Metal Sonic legit like turned super and was like nah we're gonna make all of your frames drop and that is like you're done you're, we're done playing <laughs> i don't know why the frames drop i've never actually had frames drop within this game at all and my pc is really good i just don't i don't know maybe something is going on with maybe just the mod or something like that and ooh, i think that his his spin like changes color his little diamond thing i don't know what the actual name for that is I wish I did, but I have no idea what the name of his little, like, diamond little protection shield is. And it might be something like diamond shield, it could be something simple like that, but I feel like they would name it something other than that. <laughs> but with Super Metal Sonic here, he works exactly the same as normal Metal- or normal Super Sonic. He's able to fly, um, he's completely super. I think he is a little bit faster from what it seems like. He doesn't seem like crazy fast by any means, but he does definitely seem a little bit faster than, you know, um, normal Metal Sonic in that sense. But we're coming up on the end of the stage here. So uh, this is a super pretty mod here. I'm super happy with how it turned out. And I can hope that Beats um, continues to make characters mods, and I'm sure that he probably will. Um, but I'm hoping that, you know, they continue to make some amazing different looking mods. So, but anyways, here is the gold ring. Sweet! Thanks, Tails. And he ends up keeping his same victory pose, which is super cool as well. Um, and I really like that. But I do thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I'd like to give another shout out to Beats, the creator of the Metal Sonic mod here in Project 06. So if you want to go ahead and download that mod, go ahead and check them out. And with that being said, guys, I do thank you guys so much for watching the video. Be sure to comment, like, and subscribe, and ring that bell to be notified of when I do upload. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.